Hey guys, this is part four, and I'm um, getting text text messages apparently from crazy people. Anyway, let's get started. Keith made it to the Blade of Memora, more Memora ship before Lance did, and made it to the sensor. Lance went with Fortune to look. Around frantically ignoring the paladin's questions about why he was so upset, Keith was able to confront. I'm not going to try that word anymore. Himself with the other her members, Corel dismissed them and Lance. Set his eyes on a blade of Mamora member who ran away so quickly, as quickly as possible. Keith ran faster than the speed of lan speed of light. Lance was quicker. Lance chased him around the halls. Keith made a sharp turn to the right. Opening a door to his room, Lance stopped the door from closing and shut the door behind him. His shake, his voice was shaky. Keith, it it came out as a whisper, but he froze when his head when he heard his name from Lance's lips. In the heat of the moment, neither of them heard. The door swoosh open behind him. He started shaking when Lance wrapped his arms around him, still not face, facing face to face. I'm not Keith. You have the wrong person. Sorry. Lance shook his head. Keith, I know that's you. I always rec recognize those beautiful eyes of yours. Keith refused. Refuse to start crying. Keith, take your mask off. Keith took off his mask and turned around. And Lance frowned. Turn, turn back to your human form, Keith. Keith shook his furry head. I have, don't have one. I'm full Gara. Lance remember when Gara from Ate and when they became emotional. Lance smirked. Really? He grabbed Keith's wrist and brushed, brushed back his bangs, kissing his forehead. Lance gasped. Keith gasped awfully, and sw his form switched to him. And Lance took a step back and marvel, marvel at Keith. His eyes became glossy and he embraced Keith tightly. His tight grip loosened and Keith Lance colla collapsed on his knees. He saw sobbed. Keith, I'm sorry I wasn't enough. I'm sorry. I was the reason you left. I'm sorry. I was so worthless and useless you stop loving me i'm sorry i'm sorry keith's eyes widened his eye he shook his head frankly bending down to hold lance lance no 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 please lance you're not the reason i left the reason was because i the reason i left was because dad both the males looked behind him and saw a small cover boy alex Keith widened, he wiped his eyes and opened his arms. His son ran to him and embraced him. Keith pet his son softly and spoke. Alex, turn into your human form. Lance watched his face scrunched up with hurt and confusion. Lance was a weak. Alex was obedient, did as his father told him. Suddenly, Lance was seeing a boy with sunken skin, short black hair, violet eyes. Keith looked at Lance and then looked away. 
the night I was in my Gara heat, the night we did, something happened. Neither of us knew Gara males could get pregnant. Lance looked at Keith, then Alex. So you're saying Alex is my, our son? Le Keith nodded, and Alex looked at Lance. His eyes became glossy. Papa, he ran it. He ran and hugged Lance, tightly sniffling. Lance smiled and hugged his son. Look, just as tight. Keith didn't look. He curled into a small ball, hiding his face of shame. He was shaking. I knew you wouldn't be happy. I didn't know what to do, and I was scared about your rejection and that you hated me. Lance let go of his son and wrapped his arm, his hand around Keith's head, pulling him closely and kissing him passionately. Keith, Keith's eyes widened. Keith's eyes widened, and a second later, melting in, into it, cupping Lance's cheek. Lance kissed him, pouring all of his emotions into it. His kiss, just like usual, was pure love. When they let go, both were gasping for air. Lance grinned between words, panting. I would never hate you for the greatest thing in the world. Keith Burn brush, burst into tears and collapsed onto Lance's chest. I'm such an idiot. I was so scared. Lance calmed him down by patting his head both gas when a small head popped in between them smiling all th they all hugged each other with tears and smiles and alex spoke we are a family again I am the okay curator. no one cares about the curator. okay so that's the la no this is so that was part four um tomorrow i post part five and it looks like they had another kid anyway so that's all for today make sure have a great time. See you next time and stay wild. Bye.